The crazy robots of Star Wars are much closer to reality than you might think, with Hyundai's new plan to build 4x4s with robotic legs. What Hyundai wants to build is essentially a go-anywhere vehicle that really can go anywhere and we reckon it looks a bit like an AT-AT -AT walker from Star Wars. The plan is that these off-roaders will have robotic legs that will allow them to climb up things a normal car couldn't and to get across the terrain a jeep wouldn't dare go near. There are vehicle concepts so crazy that it's difficult to think that they'll go beyond that. An example is the Hyundai Elevate, a 4x4 with insect-like legs, which was envisioned as the most capable off-roader in the world. To our surprise, Hyundai has now announced that it intends to bring these ultimate mobility vehicles to reality. The Hyundai New Horizon Studio will invest $20 million in the creation of a research center specializing in these vehicles in Montana. It's not exactly an area very close to the rest of the factories in the automotive sector, but it'll allow them to have a 1400 square meter site to test them. Hyundai Elevate Hyundai has unveiled a concept vehicle that has the ability to walk at the Consumer Electronics Show CES. Called Elevate, the ultimate mobility vehicle UMW is designed to be used by rescue services in emergencies such as natural disasters. Hyundai says it showcases technology that will be able to take people where no vehicle has been before. It says the Elevate could be used to reduce disaster response times by making it easier for emergency vehicles to get through the rubble of collapsed structures. John Su, head of Hyundai's technology development arm, Cradle said, current rescue vehicles can only deliver responders to the edge of the debris field. They have to go to the rest of the way by foot. The Elevate can drive to the scene and climb right over flood debris or crumbled concrete. Another preview showing the concept as a city taxi demonstrates how such technology could make it easier for passengers to travel around difficult environments. The Elevate sits atop a modular electric vehicle platform which allows for the easy installation of different body shells if necessary. Each wheel is independently powered and this alongside a 15-foot track width allows the vehicle to move with mammalian and reptilian walking gates. In drive mode, the legs are stowed away and a more conventional passive suspension system is activated. Hyundai claims the concept is capable of driving at normal motorway speeds. Hyundai Tiger The Tiger is the firm's second ultimate mobility vehicle UMV concept following in the footsteps of 2019's four-legged Elevate emergency response vehicle. Like the Elevate, its wheels are joined to its modular platform via unique jointed legs which offer significantly raised ride height and 360-degree directional control. It's envisioned as a mobile scientific exploration platform for use in hostile environments that conventional vehicles struggle to negotiate and is capable of full autonomous driving. The electric concept operates like a conventional four-wheel drive vehicle with its legs retracted, but it can extend to its full height when faced with an obstruction. With the ability to extend each of its four legs to varying lengths, the Tiger can keep any payload completely level regardless of its angle of attack. Hyundai said the vehicle can be delivered to its destination by an unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, and its fully electric powertrain charged en route. The Tiger is the result of collaboration between Hyundai Motor Group's New Horizon Studio in California and software company Autodesk. The two firms work together to create a lightweight but incredibly strong structure with an innovative carbon fiber composite additive printing process used for elements of the chassis and legs. Its makers claim it's ideal for 360-degree surface evaluation in areas struck by natural disaster while tackling challenging terrain or even exploring the surface of another moon or planet. John Such, head of the New Horizon Studio, said, Vehicles like Tiger and the technologies underpinning it give us an opportunity to push our imaginations. We're constantly looking at ways to rethink vehicle design and development and redefine the future of transportation and mobility. For the development of these vehicles, Hyundai will initially have about 50 workers. The challenge is, beyond the body of the vehicle, to build the different sensors and control systems that allow having up to 6 degrees of freedom in each leg, a necessary mobility so that the vehicle can be driven correctly despite how irregular the terrain is. The Korean company planted a stake in the ground when it acquired Boston Dynamics in June 2021. The US firm had already developed a reputation for developing cutting-edge robotic technology, including a robotic dog playfully named Spot. The 70-pound four-legged machine has already found a place in automotive manufacturing. Hyundai rivaled Ford last year put several of them to work, precisely mapping out the interiors of its factories. Since Hyundai bought Boston Dynamics, it has given birth to a factory service robot based on Spot, a robot dog. This time, the engineering and robotics design company has updated the terrifyingly cute robot with better sensors, a new tablet controller, and a smarter and faster charger. Apparently, it also gained better dancing chops. Spot now has five stereo cameras all over its body, which provide full-color imagery. While the robot itself doesn't need a cutter to see, the integration of cutters is for the operator's view. This makes deciphering the robot's environment easier through the Scout Remote Operation Software or tablet. 
Speaking of tablets, Spot also gets a new tablet, which will be the biggest upgrade for the robot dog's operators. It's used to either drive the robot or for autonomous missions, now integrated with smarter features. Meanwhile, Spot's charger is now faster and smarter. Charging the battery to full capacity only takes an hour, though swapping batteries is still the easiest and fastest way to get Spot back to operation. Ever since Hyundai bought Boston Dynamics in 2020, Hyundai has utilized the robot in various ways. Kia's South Korean plant has employed one in service in September 2021, a factory safety service robot developed for various industrial tasks, particularly in people detection, high temperature situations and fire hazards monitoring, and checking if a door is closed or open. Spot also appeared in a promotional Hyundai video that featured the automaker's global brand ambassador and worldwide music phenomenon, BTS. The robot dog showed some serious dancing skills there, though we can argue that it's newfound talent. At this point, we're seeing Spot in a different light. Far from our initial impression, we just hope it sticks to dancing and factory service work rather than picking up weapons like in Black Mirror's Metalhead episode. Boston Robotics has focused on giving robots more than just added strength. It uses sensors that can provide the machine's situational awareness, the ability to see and understand what's going around them, and athletic intelligence. It allows Spot, for example, to walk much like a dog, even climbing stairs or scampering over obstacles. Longer-term robots will be capable of becoming physical avatars for a human, Hyundai officials predicted. Using virtual reality gear and an internet connection, a technician might be able to skip traveling to a remote location, essentially becoming one with a robot that can make repairs. Robots can operate in places where people shouldn't go, added Raybird, noting that several Boston Dynamics robots now operate at the Baden Fukushima nuclear plant site of a meltdown a decade ago. We'll be able to control the robots as if we were actually there, added Hyundai Song. Of course, the future capabilities envisioned by Hyundai and Boston Dynamics won't be limited to automotive plants, officials stressed during Tuesday evening's presentation. The same technologies could be used to better enable the elderly and handicapped, and it could even permit a child to link up with a robotic avatar on Mars to explore the red planet through the metaverse Hyundai predicted. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications to see more of our future videos. With that said, keep enjoying our videos, and I'll see you in the next video.